talk you guys can we talk please i i i, I would like to talk y'all with me can we talk we gonna talk okay cool how you guys doing i hope everything is well if everything is not well just know it will get well you just have to keep pressing today i'm running some errands today it's a day off had a really 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 nice weekend you guys i i went to two comedy shows hey, i saw chris rock <sighs> girl <sighs> when i tell you he is funny girl it was hilarious on saturday night we saw mike epps and mike epps is my favorite comedian like <laughs> i love me some day day girl he had us crying and the two guys before him were it was mike epps and friends a lot of comedy a lot of laughter this weekend which was definitely needed yesterday i went to the store because i was away for a long about a week and i spent four hundred dollars it's not that i spent four hundred dollars it's the fact that what i got for four hundred dollars was not sufficient to the money i spent and what i wanted to talk to you guys about is i got I have a lot of y'all asking like, are you still doing body contouring? Do you still have get it right? Like what's going on? I, I wouldn't say a lot of y'all. I probably got the question like maybe two or three times over the last couple of weeks. And the answer to the question is yes. Yes, I am get it right will forever be. However, planning on shifting my services. It's been a long time coming. I've been initially, thank you. Yes, my son brought my tripod so I don't have to hold this phone. Thank you, God. At first, he wasn't going to do it because I had sent him back in the house like 27 times. <laughs> and he was like, Mom. And you don't know, understand that because I be the same way. But then he felt, he, my son is so sweet because he talk a good game. But at the end of the day, like he's a good person. So his conscience would not allow him to not go get me that last thing I needed. So he was like, where is it at? <laughs> just back up a little bit the entire body contouring thing is great and i love it and if i could do it for eternity i would you guys know that i had to have an emergency spontaneous abortion but it was more of like a tubal pregnancy that had to be removed and with that they had to take out a part of my female organs last year and you guys i've been having complications ever since that incident if you know you know so that said i have been needing to have an additional surgery to fix the complication but for one reason or another I had I didn't I didn't have the surgery the first time week before the surgery I was in Vegas <laughs> this epiphany in Vegas that I was just gonna live live with the with the pain because I am a mighty morphic fucking power ranger so the doctor called me after that like, miss get it right well you can you come in so I went in etc 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 okay so they schedule it again well before you go into the hospital you have to have a COVID test took the COVID test COVID test came back positive although I didn't have any symptoms so it was weird but y'all want to know about that link was postponed so I get a new date they call me about four weeks before the date and they're like the doctor has an email it's gonna have to be out of town that week we gotta reschedule you girl so i'm like faith is literally telling me that this is not the right thing to do because why you know why has it got stopped you know postponed so many times but at the same time it's like it has to be done it's so weird there's really not any other alternative so you guys that said i have a new date and it's coming up here shortly here and i pretty much adjusted client schedule to 
I was pretty much going to be off for like three or four weeks. I, I didn't readjust my schedule. I was like, I'm just going to take the way I ain't having surgery, but I'm just going to take the time because it was planned. I needed it. And truthfully, when I'm working as a body contour tourist, I'm standing on my feet. I'm doing wood therapy. Like it's, it hurts. It hurts. So I really needed to pull back because I was moving into memberships. I was moving into this new service. It just kind of all worked out to my benefit to that. I'm not taking new body contouring clients. I'm just seeing my members and my VIP clients who are on a regular monthly maintenance i hope that makes sense so my days are shorter my body contouring work is you could call it repetitive because these are returning clients they're maintenance clients they're members of get it right by t so the videos are they would be redundant i'm not doing anything new per se so that is why the body contouring content has kind of slowed down um, in the beginning I recorded as much as I could and showed you guys as much as I could without you know exposing people who didn't want to be exposed and then I had that whole 90 day issue of recovering and that was I still have never really recovered to be honest and you know, here we are in the summer months. And yeah, I'm just not filming because it would be redundant things to film. I'm not working as on as many people as I was in the beginning. And that is what's working for me in life right now. You guys, make sure to stay tuned for the new service. Those videos are coming. That's what we needed to talk about. I hope you guys understand that. I will be back in the studio this week to film a few things for y'all. I have a, a update to my what I wish I had known. And I, I think that's going to be pretty dope because if you are interested in getting into this business, which I say go for it because it's very, very lucrative. It is very flexible in that you make your own schedule you can do what you want or don't do what you don't want and um you're helping people and if that's what you're into i i say go for it life has kind of gave me a little twist in the road and that's okay we're gonna keep going i can keep up with the demand and so i'm i'm pivoting i'm pivoting i'm not giving it up completely because i love it haven't been taking in new body contouring clients and i don't plan on taking in new body contouring clients now if something changes and you know i'm back to 100 percent, then i will but as of right now it's just not it's not really feasible for me at this point in time so that's that on that thank you so much for watching i hope that answered y'all's questions if you guys want to see anything from me in this space please leave a comment below like the video if you learn something new or if you see something you like and i'll see you guys in the next one get it right